playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Leicester City up against Crystal Palace. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And so the match is underway. And the lineup for Leicester City. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside James Madison in central midfield and operating through the middle in attack, Jamie Vardy. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Well read to put an end to that attack. Good pressure high up the pitch. Lovely work to get past his man. And space to cross it. A striker you can simply never write off. Jamie Vardy, of course, he has so much know-how. Stuart, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Well, Derek, we know his movement is very clever, but it's the speed of that movement that causes defenders so many problems. He's got great pace, he gets 1v1 against the goalkeepers, and nobody can recover. Schloop. He's got to score! Foiling his opponent completely. James Madison. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Schlup. Tyrick Mitchell. Ezzy. Now, looking dangerous here. Can they forge ahead? a superb save James Madison well I still don't know how he kept that out Derek it's a fantastic save to keep it all square well it was a splendid piece of goalkeeping but he has to remain on his toes Zaha must be oh did so well to deny him Played over. Well, the danger is still there. And problem solved for now. He read the situation defensively and did his job. With the owner of the Blink Lock registration BG04DOM, please return to your vehicle with a maximum. Schlup. And Zaha has it. Palace now in potentially a dangerous position. Schloop. Now the attack fizzled out. This might be ideal for the counter. Crossing opportunity. Couldn't outwit the keeper. <laughs> Pressing high to win the ball. The cross is on. The save was a good one. Oh. 
And there's the delivery. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Well, no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the King Power. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. Harvey Barnes. Timothy Castagna. And taken away. He won the ball. Schloop. Oh, surely! Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, those stats really do tell you everything. So many chances, but yet so little end product. At some point, though, you sense they're going to get the breakthrough. Yes, you definitely get that feeling as they go to work once more. Very quick thinking there. Barney. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Could be threatening. Harvey Barnes. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. And Palace could get in behind the defence. And he cuts inside. And clears the danger. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. Who can he pick out? Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Anderson. Real chance. Squanders the chance for 1-0. Well, that's a big miss. They should be leading now. Tielemans Mark Albrighton now he's got space Ricardo Pereira real chance oh and the crossbar getting in the way and a goal kick coming up an interceptor there oh beating his opponent with ease well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Vardy. Jamie Vardy now. All Brighton. Now Ricardo Pereira has it. And a goal at this stage might well turn out to be decisive. Cross towards that far post. And it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it left the boot. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Harvey Barnes must take the lead here. And danger still. Well, high and more than a bit hopeful. Ducouré. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes. And he's through here. Still a chance. 
Oh, what a crucial save that is. Well, that could have been the winner, but he's so good in those 1v1 situations. Over it comes. Can he put it away? And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes.